Welcome back to Happy Change. A little bit of ASMR to get started. It is day two of sertraline. So medication's been in my system now 48 hours and I just want to share where I'm at in terms of side effects. It's too soon for the medication to be having like a positive effect on my body. However, it's worth reminding you that the process of seeking help, which is what you have to do to be prescribed the medication, means that invariably what you'll do is you'll start to feel more empowered and more in control of your life. So if you're at home and you are struggling with your depression, your anxiety, your mental health, please, 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 please go speak to your doctor. I am not a trained medical person. Make sure you seek the advice from the appropriate people. However, do join in the conversation. Make sure that you share your story, ask any questions that you've got. I will do my best to answer them. So, day two. If you've watched any of the videos so far, and if you haven't, it's a good place to start. As always, link up in the corner, watch the playlist. So, start from day zero. You'll know that the side effects haven't been this bad this time round. Uh, last time, they kind of impacted me. Um, more severely, but not as severely as antidepressants can. So right now, a little bit of nausea, but not too much. I slept deeply again last night, which is ace. So I felt I woke up rested and I actually woke up quite early as well. So it felt like I wasn't just stuck in bed, like I was able to wake up. I think I woke up at half six, which is nuts because I went to bed at one, maybe. But I felt fine. No problems there. Weird dreams still there. Maybe not weird, but quite vivid dreams. So the dreams so far have been positive, nothing negative has occurred. So I am seeing that as a plus at the moment. To be able to have dreams, I think, is pretty cool. I think that's just because I'm sleeping deeply. So I, I don't know how the science of sleep, maybe someone can tell me, but I think that when you when you are sleeping deeply or REM sleep, whatever it's called, I think that's when dreams occur. I might be completely wrong. Maybe I've just made that up. But I think because I am less restless in the in the night I think that's why I'm having more dreams so the only kind of physical thing that's happening at the moment and it's the time of year anyway is that I feel a bit of a sore throat coming on I feel like I've got a couple of ulcers developing at the back of my throat so that might be a side effect it might just be because it's the time of year there's lots of people coughing and spluttering and spreading germs so that's day two when you're ready watch day three otherwise Keep in touch with the channel, leave a comment, share your story, you never know who it is going to help.